In this tutorial, we will continue our work with Morse code. Note for more information on Morse code, you can go to wikipedia.org and search Morse code. Start the PAVE IDE. Recall that anything typed in the console is sent over a serial port to the Arduino. We will take input from the console and parse it character by character. We will provide some basic code for you to set things up. Take a look. We've got some comments at the top. The function prototypes for dot and dash just as before. In the setup function, we have we change pin 13 to be an output. We also start the serial port at 9600 baud. Note in the loop function, we take input if it's available from the serial port and then we do a switch case block. Basically this is the same as an if, else if, else statement. It's just more concise. Let's save this project and compile it. Recall we have to start a reservation. Now let's flash the code to the device. Now let's try sending a serial command. Great. Now it's time for a programming challenge. Turn this application into a Morse code translator. For example, when a user types the letter D, your program will display a dash and two dots. You might want to add a delay if a user types a space. Please refer to back to the last tutorial on Morse code if you need to refresh yourself on this material. This conclu concludes this tutorial.